Hi, Irene here. I wanted to shoot this video and talk to you about um, the economy. Yesterday when I was driving with my husband in the car, there was a car that passed us and it was a little bit bigger than uh, the smart car. You know the smart car, the little two-seater that God forbid somebody hit you, you'd probably get killed in it. There was a car by Nissan. I don't, I think it's brand new because I don't remember the name of it, but I know it was a Nissan and it was a four-door. and it was, it was small, just a little bit bigger than the smart car. And my husband out of the clear blue sky turns around and he says, he says, you see, that's what the government wants us to ride around in while they're up on Capitol Hill riding around in their limos and we're putting, we're flipping the bill for it and we're also paying for the gas. And it just struck me so funny the way he said it. It came out of the clear blue sky, but it's so true. And today, I am at work. It's Saturday. Uh, we come in, uh, I start at 9, I work till about 2. But anyway, I'm not busy right now, so I was up at the front desk, and I was talking with the girl who runs the front desk, the receptionist. She's a young girl. She's 23 years old. Her name is Tara. She's a sweet thing. And she lives with a boyfriend, and she's very, very responsible for her age. And her uh, boyfriend, he owns his own business. But, you know, we were, like, talking about how expensive everything is. And so she works, and he, you know, has a small business. And he used to ride around in a truck, uh, which he loved. I mean, you know, he, but he does a lot of riding around, traveling back and forth, uh, because he's a bells bondsman. So he was putting gas in his car, like, every three, four days. And, you know, the tank that they have, you know, it's probably ran about maybe 75 bucks. And it was crazy. So perfect example, he was forced to um, downsize to an economy car, and I believe he's got an Ultima, which I have. But, you know, we're older Americans, and, and we like riding around in those beautiful, you know, nice little sedans. Um, but he's a young fella, and he wants, you know, he would like to drive around in a truck, and he can't. And this is how this established, and this economy, this establishment and the economy has forced him to downsize. And it's just crazy in this day and age that everybody is forced to downsize to smaller cars so they have better uh, gas mileage, <clears throat> maybe downsize their houses. Everything has to be downsized. Meanwhile, the government, they're all getting bigger and fatter, on, and we're paying for it. So this is why this business has drawn me to it, because it's a way of getting out of this everyday rut. Um, I love the Empower uh, Network organization. Uh, they help people to uh, create an extra income, and a lot of people have actually quit their 9 to 5 jobs. And um, that's why I want to tell you that you can do the same thing. Uh, if you're interested in learning how to uh, earn an extra income so that you don't have to downsize, that you can uh, work your way to being financially free, just click the link below and uh, join us.